Hey guys, it's me, Vaxid, and welcome back to Captain Forever Remix. We are gonna finally make some good use of this daggum missile kit. Even if we have to abandon the missile concept right out the gate. So I've been playing, I've been playing Captain Forever while I have been at work. And I, yeah, of course I'm enjoying myself. I, you know, I'm loving this game. I put about five hours into this game total. And, you know, it's just one of those games I find the replayability is there. I'm not going to try and spoil it too much. But what we're going to do is we're going to jump right on into our first sector. I've been learning more setups, so to speak. When I come across more weapons, I'll show you more about what about more about, more about what I mean. But missiles, missiles are very particular. You want missiles to have the range advantage because that's what they that's what they have. I also notice that they are very very proficient when you're backing up. It's very good to just if you have thrusters on the front of your ship, boom, you pull one of these. You just you do what I'm doing here. See, and now we got parts. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna stick that booger right there. I'm gonna stick one here. See, I lost my front blaster. Sucks. I know, but my proficiency when it comes to backing up now is way better. And honestly, if you just avoid your opponent as much as possible, you'll be completely fine when it comes to a missile build. Now this is a different sort of setup. I don't want to kill his rocket launcher. I want it because if I get my hands on it, I can. Ooh, actually, I'm gonna kill this guy real quick. If I can get my hands on his rocket on his missile launcher. Yeah, there we go. That was actually a great shot. We want shots like that. We want cockpit destruction. We don't want entire ship destruction. See, now that sucks. So now the rest of his ship is meaningless to me. This guy, I would like his blaster, but it's not something I'm going to go hunting for. See, I'm, I'm fine with how that turned out. I'm not happy about it, so to speak, but I am okay with it. So what are we going to do now, guys? What we're going to do... So we're going to zoom out here. We're actually going to come over here. And I have been learning that when you have parts, you use parts. We don't have we don't have a ton to make use of here. But we have enough that we can definitely uh, make do, so to speak. We're going to stick those here. We're actually going to stick a couple on the sides. The reason I'm sticking these on the side is because it will help with my turning capabilities. And what I'm actually going to do is I think there's another blaster over here I believe was there another blaster yeah there is we're gonna stick those here actually what we're gonna do is we're just gonna pull out these middle sections replace them with yellows the parts are gonna come with us so I'm not concerned about getting it all built crazy quickly we're just gonna stick our ship together here real good so how have your guys' day been I'm uh uh, it's about 7 a.m. for me right now. I, you know, I just got off work a little while ago, and yeah, I just thought, well, hey, why not do some videos? Do some videos. My parts, as you can see, are a bit damaged. I am looking to replace. But you're probably wondering, hey, Vax, what's with the what's with the deal of? Actually, I could, I could pull this out and replace it with a nice solid bulkhead. What's the deal with airline food? No, what's the deal with the blasters on the side? What are you doing? Well, I've discovered that if you can pull drive-bys, they are so much more efficient than just head-on approaches. Head-on approaches leave you vulnerable. Drive-bys leave you with more ta um, leave you constantly moving. It gives you more of a tactical prowess. This guy is actually going to be the best bonus of all time. We're going to hopefully get some super sweet kills on him. He's actually taking a while to die simply because of the idea that... Or not the idea, but simply because of the design that yellow weapons and armor or bulkheads have more durability. And they fire faster, so he was actually able to mitigate a lot of my damage. It's, you know, not great to have to deal with that. But because of this long-range sniper being out here, we're going to try and... I want to just destroy his... I want to just destroy his cockpit without destroying the rest of his build. Unfortunately, as you can see, his, cock his uh, bulkheads there have a lot of durability. Now we got rid of the yellow one, that's good, we're making progress. We gotta get through the oranges, I don't want to destroy his orange blasters. Or his blaster, I want it. I, I need it, you know. Well, maybe not need, but, you know, it's something I would like. Ah, shoot, this guy is actually gonna be a pain. 
Well, we're gonna we're gonna actually try to get rid of the sniper here first. Yeah, there we go. And okay, I don't think we got anything out of him. It sucks. We're actually gonna destroy this guy's gun. It's okay. It's uh, it's not great. I actually think his command module is about to go down. Yeah, there we go. Did we get good? Did we get anything good? We got some things. We got some good things. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna pull that out. We're gonna stick that in its place. Huh, what to do here? I think we're gonna pull this out. This one is damaged. Unfortunately, do it. I still want it. I'm still gonna take it. And this, this I don't need as much. You know, I don't really need a green laser. A green laser isn't going to give me a ton of good use. What I want, I need upgraded missiles. This is not going to be, you know, I'm going to be up shit creek without a paddle if I don't have upgraded missiles because I want to run missile boat. <laughs> Last time I ended up running missile boat off, or a missile boat off camera, I ended up having like a really wide front and I had a lot of rows of missiles, but the downside was that I could never close that gap. I could never get close enough to someone where my missiles could fire and I wouldn't, like, somehow in their line of sight. Or in their range, I mean. Forgive my lack of co cohesion today. Morning. Whatever. Whatever time it is for you, that's what's important. You know, it, it's important that you're here hanging out with me. That's, that's great to know. And thank you for your patronage. Really messed up galaxy. What we need to find, what I want is our level is what I want is uh, enemies who are about level two. I'll fight level two enemies. If I can get level two missiles, it'll make destroying level four enemies way easier. I got a bonus, so I'm at the level four section. I'm gonna avoid that guy because I feel like he's just gonna give me trouble. Looking for the radars. Really wish I had a radar. Is that a f is that a six? Is that a five over there? Okay, there we go. That's where we want to go. I thought I saw the radar of a level 5 ship, and I, I was just like, it was new. Okay, this guy didn't actually seem that bad. I actually think he's... No, he's not dormant, but... Shoot. 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 Eh. Alright, we're gonna destroy this guy's front-facing gun. Unfortunately for us, but, you know, actually, I think we're going to be destroying all of his guns because he got light bolt heads. That's what happens, scrub. It's okay, we could use the cash, and soon enough we'll have the cash for the upgrade that um, gives us the repair on destruction of enemy ships. That will be insanely helpful. Shoot. Yeah, I know you got a fish piloting it, but come on, you don't want to flounder. <laughs> oh, shit! I try to fight, fight a war on two fronts over here. Not that I want to, but sometimes it's how you gotta do things. If I can just destroy his cockpit, I'll have me some new shiny weapons. Okay, with destroying that. I lost the missiles, which is the worst thing about this exchange. Oh, shiza. Destroy him, get out! Destroy him, get out! No! Need his... Need his missiles! Ah, fuck it. You know what? We're gonna have to make do here. We need a real weapon. There we go. That will work. What we need to do is get around this guy. I just want this. I just want to destroy your your freaking cockpit. That's all I want is to kill you and your kind and end you. I'm gonna end up losing my own cockpit here. Unfortunately, it looks like. All right, one gun down. I'm okay with losing these guns. I just want him to be dead. Yes, that was beautiful. I mean, yeah, it turned out you know badly on multiple fronts, but. It's okay. You know, it is okie dokie all up in here. Is there another one? Yeah, there is. 
Okay, so now we're good. Now we got some propulsion. Now we are cooking with peanut oil. What else do we want? Actually, we're gonna stick that gun right there. So that way, our cockpit is protected. Yes. Yes. Good, 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 good. Oh, sh Oh, you did not just <laughs> destroy what I worked so hard to achieve, you fool! You've doomed yourself! Well, he destroyed one of our missiles, which is bad, but not unsalvageable, if you get what I mean. This is still a situation that's gonna be, you know, viable for us. We've still got our front-facing gun, and that is fine. What we're actually gonna do now is we're gonna mix the setup around. We are gonna put two front-facing guns here, because I feel like even though we're lacking with missiles now, we can get missiles later, and we've got two orange guns. These orange guns, unfortunately, I have to use as pretty much meat shield for the rest of our build, but... Alright, that's something. Actually, no, it's not. It's not that much. This guy has long-range weapons. We could potentially make use of those. If we get around him, we can stick those on the sides, and we'll be okay. Alright, he gave us one of them, and it's damaged. Well, that sucks. Uh, what we can do is we'll stick that there, and we'll stick one there. It'll make uh, turning easier. The reason you're probably thinking, Vax, is why do you have a blaster on one side and a jet on the other? Well, the good reason for that innocent viewer who doesn't know anything more than I do, the, I have that there because they both have a mass of one, and it will balance out the ship. I'm, I'm doing it for the sake of keeping the ship in good condition. That is long-range destructive shots. If I get hit by those, I'm screwed. I'm getting the hell out of here. Yeah, I know you'll destroy me. That's why I'm leaving. See, this guy. This is the kind of guy we want. Now, you're, you're probably looking at him like, why do you, would you want this? Well, there's a good reason why we want this. We're going to destroy these first. We're eventually going to eat through this bulkhead. Actually, Alright, here's what we're gonna do instead. It's a bit less idiotic than what I was doing. We just want- yes! We destroyed his cockpit. That is good. Because I can take that off. Throw that there. Throw that there. Throw that here. Crap! We need to move. We need to move. We need to move. That big baddie's coming out after us. We gotta go! Gotta go! See ya! Later! Alright. As you can see, we do not resemble a missile boat anymore. <laughs> but that's okay. Sometimes you don't have to, to get the job done. We are gonna make mincemeat out of this guy. I want... I want your life. I want your life. Yes! We got guns. Good. Wait, is that guy still coming? What is with this guy? His dedication is unreal. Oh my gosh. Um, no. No. I have no interest in you. I gotta use the space to breathe. Yes. Uh, actually, he has a lot of turning power. We're gonna go see if we can find someone else who's a bit less mean. We're gonna need more jet fuel, to or we're gonna need more propulsion. But until then, we will be okay. Uh, you look armed and dangerous, and I don't think I'm gonna get around you effectively. I want this to destroy his front-facing gun, but I also don't want to deal with him and this other guy. Yeah, there's no way that's gonna work. Shiza, how is this gun so strong? Oh shit! Uh, we're not looking good, boys. We're gonna have to move. See ya! Out of range. Good, good, good. Uh, this is still pretty bad though for us. But what we can do is just mix up our setup a bit. We have less side power, which means less strafing power, which is generally bad. But, however, we can still pull this out. We don't have to get her pregnant, we can pull out. Oh crap, Hola, what is this sort of abomination? Uh, actually you're both you're both at that level. Oh, shit. <laughs> well then. 
This game will not let you simply learn from your mistakes. You will be punished. And that was the case where I was punished. But what we are going to buy now is Auto Repeller Salvage. When we destroy a ship, the modules that it drops will be healed. Yeah, think about that one. So, what else do we want? What else can we get? Like, do we have to just use Missile Kit for right now? Beam Kit, Missile Kit. Yeah, we're going to need to just use Missile Kit. It's okay. What we'll do is we'll upgrade some Evasion Chance. That will give us... Uh, more evasion. <laughs> anyway, put that there. We're gonna make a phallus. And put those there. We still have our guns. We still have missiles. Um, unfortunately, we're pretty dry back here, but you know what? That's okay. We find a ship. We destroy it. We get some propulsion. We're more balanced out. Our turning ability, excuse me, our swiveling ability is very good. However, our turning ability is lacking. Simply because these boosters have to constantly be in thrust in order for ours to have our propulsion in the first place. This guy is the kind of guy I want to fight. However, I don't want to destroy his missiles. No, 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 no. Okay, I'm gonna have to destroy his missiles. It sucks, but I've come to terms with it. Really does suck a lot. But luckily, since he's, yeah, he's driving forward, so his parts were exposed. I'll we'll reach pretty far out there. Yeah, there we go. We've now got some side power, which is good. It's not the best, but it will make do. I'm going to be looking to upgrade modules soon enough. I really need more defenses in the back. <laughs> hubba hubba, if you guys know what I mean. We, this guy is destroyed. Easy peasy. We are just gonna change our modules real quick. We didn't damage his bulkheads, and if we did, it's not badly enough for me to be able to tell. Now we have much more defense in our rear. Our front gun is unfortunately there. It's not what I want. I want to get a gun in order to stick on top of our cockpit, so that way we can have just a little bit of a meat shield, you know what I mean? I would love to stick a bulkhead and then an equal colored gun in the front, but it's just one of those things how many times you had to rebuild your ship so far? None, jerk! Where are all of the baddies? What I would love to get would be to expand outwards down here and get some dual thrusters. There's our level three. How well equipped is he? Very. We're gonna leave. See ya. Goodbye. Have a nice day. Uh, leave me alone forever. This guy, I have a bit more of an interest in. What I want is to line my gun up with his missiles so I can basically eat the sh shots. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna have to destroy his guns. This sucks. But it's okay. I believe missiles do AOE damage. I'm not entirely sure. He is luckily the worst pilot of all time. So we are in the cli- Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, he had me. He still has me. He has me. He has me in the sights. He's got the locked on phasers. We're gonna die, aren't we? No, please, please. Yes, yes. No, no. Yes, yes. No, no. Yes, yes. We have to destroy his guns. Oh, this sucks. I don't want to destroy his guns. You're gonna die for your transgressions against me. That's right, you better bail. Coward. Think I won't chase you down. Oh my gosh, he's a level 3 too. <sighs> no. Dang it. I can't catch him. My propulsion's not good enough. That is the worst situation that you will see happen if you make the decision to pick up this game, which I highly recommend still. I, I do love this game to death. It, it is definitely not the kind of game that I'm going to, you know, be like the Fizz Snap of the Binding of Isaac at, um, or the Northern Lion of the Binding of Isaac at, but it is definitely the kind of game I could see myself spending too much time on. 
Actually, this is a really good opportunity for us to do what I was talking about earlier. Yeah, it, it gives it gives our guns some pseudo range. What I mean by that is its range is only enhanced because of bulkheads and not because of actual range of gun. Now, for this guy, I have faith in our ability to kill him. I don't have faith in our ability to survive all of his fire. Actually, I do have, I do now have much more faith in our ability to survive his fire. You are gonna die, buddy. What I want is your gun. That's what I want from you, is your gun. See, I'm trying to target his propulsion. Obviously a little bit harder. Easier said than oh no 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 you misunderstand like I don't want to destroy You die. You die now. I think he's gonna try to fail. That is so stupid. Whatever. What we're gonna do is we're gonna upgrade parts. I am infuriated with how that turned out. All I wanted was his gun, but no. You can't have nice things here. Can't have. Oh, dude, fuck that up. Oop. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and jump. Man. Man. Oh man. Okay. Back to Venus. Kevin's Crusaders, more like more like Kevin's Pusaders. <laughs> anyway, finding the enemies, finding meat to kill, fresh meat. I would slay you. You will die. Goodbye, fool. Time for you to perish. There we go. Um, did I really need any of this? No, I don't. Oh, well, hello. I guess we might as well take a chance. <laughs> oh. You know, I... You can call me He of Little Faith. But I am He of Little Faith. I was going to make a Land Before Time joke there, but oh my gosh, I have eight. I'm actually okay if we destroy his gun. I'm, I'm fine with that. I might just end him. Oh my gosh, that worked. I mean, of course it worked. I never had any doubt. None at all. I had no faith in that at all. None whatsoever. But that means we get to upgrade. I think we're going to start expanding outward. Probably thinking this is a pretty bad idea. You know what? I don't disagree. But we're going to do it. It's not going to stop me. I've never been stopped before. Why would you think now would be the time I'd be stopped? We're going to put some blasters here. We had oranges, right? Yeah, oranges would be good. Stick some oranges on the sides there. Put an orange for our propulsion, and we are in the money when it comes to swivel. Wow, and now we run missiles. Wow, we're fast. Jeez, look at that. Jeez, looking like Sanic over here. Let me go break out my amiibos. No one can get faster. Speaking of amiibos, I need to get more amiibos. I've been trying to find a Meta Knight for what feels like months now. I'm so glad I picked up Sonic and Mega Man when I did. I mean, even though if they're readily available, ooh, even though they are readily available, it seems like. Okay, okay, okay. Play it cool, 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 play it cool. Play it cool. Yes, I know we lost the front, the front missile launcher. It's okay. It actually didn't bother me. It actually kind of bothers me a great deal. There we go. No. Problemo. Uh, let's just run long range. We're gonna have to move though, like ASAP, like immediately.
There we go, now we got the range advantage. I think we're gonna end up just destroying both sides of the ships. I don't want that. I want just to destroy his front gun and anything blocking his cockpit. Fuck him! No, you don't get to live. We don't tolerate living here. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Nope. You don't get to. You get to die. Phew. You better scream, Uncle. <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> hubba hubba. Anyway, it's level six. Is a problem. Seeing as he just destroyed one of our missiles, seeing as they just destroyed both of our missiles, seeing as we're probably gonna be dead any minute now. These are, this is what happens when you make poor decisions, guys. Oh my gosh, look at this guy. Uh, we're. Oh shit, creep. Right about now. Uh, yeah, yeah, this is getting bad. This is exactly what we don't want. We're gonna die. It was uh, nice knowing you. I've made poor decisions. Very poor. Very poor indeed. I didn't actually mean to die like that. <laughs> oh man, this is proven to be kind of tougher than the others. I really want to get melee kit, but I had to reach Mars, and I couldn't reach Mars. But I think we'll try and reach Mars next time. Thank you guys very much for watching. If you liked this video, please leave a like. If you didn't like this video, please leave a comment telling me why you didn't like it. If you were feeling some more complicated than this, please leave a comment telling me what I could do better or what other games you want me to play. Please subscribe, help my channel grow, subscribers. And I will see you guys next time.